Hi everyone, welcome back to XCOM, and we got another covert data recovery mission. And yeah, that's uh, Excellent. pretty much it. We look forward to seeing your progress. These aren't exactly the best people along for the ride, but it's the best we can bring along. So let's go. A lot of them don't even have like their core abilities. Simply because I made them go, a lot of them go on the, the previous mission, so. Touching down. I mean, even if we can't do this, it's okay. We're moving to eliminate an exalt cell currently operating within the United States. We'll need to protect our assets in this area in order to secure the necessary intel. My hope is that they just kind of zergling onto the, the point, uh, wherever it is, and then we're just gonna go just fuck along them from the safety of some nice hardcover. Hardcover. Our operative was in position to transmit the data they'd acquired when Exalt forces moved into their AO. The encoder is currently shielding our transmitter's position, but if Exalt manages to hack the encoder, they'll be able to locate the transmitter. If they hack both, any hope we had of recovering the data intact will be lost. New objective received. So, that's the only one we see here? Really? Well, this map kind of sucks. All right, let's start off with a with a move. Out. We're just gonna go into the building because did you see her kind of running into the the wall there? That was great. I love I love that. Target confirmed. I don't know why we can hear them, but whatever. Oh, where's my sniper? Right, go right over there. Ten four. Pretty much for the plan is to go to these double doors. We'll leave this little thing alone for now. Uh, Moving. We're gonna just go right up here. So I positioned myself just perfectly so that they will not be able to see me. Great, they're already in the point. I started literally on the opposite side of the map. And someone is attempting to access the encoder, Commander. We can't allow Exalt to hack that equipment or they're going to locate the transmitter. Okay. Like it's honestly I really have I'm sprinting and I still don't have time to make it all the way up there. It's, it's kinda of fucking kind dumb. I'm sorry. Moving out. Uh let's see. Who does well if they don't move? The infantry. Fortunately, I don't really have a choice when it comes to him. Yes, sir. I already really don't like this, just because it like they're already there. Rolling out. Okay, so in one turn he can go get that if if needed. So they're all active now. Commander, we've got multiple hostiles inbound on strike one's position. Enemy reinforcements are closing in. Well, I did see one thing up there, so. Where's my rocketeer? Alright. You open the door? Thanks. This is my Overwatch one, by the way. Damn it. Gotta go down slightly. Uh, I'm gonna just, you know, I'm gonna get to get the car like this. With pleasure. I hope that blowing up that car doesn't affect the encoder. It'd be really dumb if it did. But generally speaking, there's a lot of people here. There's a lot of people here. Alright. Where's my grenader? Engineer, go be credit to team. Alright. 
I guess that, that thing doesn't blow up at all. Okay. Oh, there we go. And we got a bunch of them there. Oh, that car is going to blow up. I can guarantee you that we're going over here. If our operative gets close enough to access one of the communications relays Exalt has nearby, they should be able to use the encryption keys from the intel to temporarily disable the enemy's comm system. Wait, wait, where did... Oh, no, my sniper is actually back here. I see. Alright, we're gonna do the full chance to crit against the guy there. Look at that. 100% chance to hit, 100% chance to crit. And he's got, like, a huge health bar, so... I'm up for that. Yeah, that's one way of getting rid of them. Got it. I mean, I'm, I'm like, I'm already here, and I'm, I'm trying to figure out like what the fuck I want to do to the point, because they're all, they're already all on top of it. God damn, these guys suck. Well, I can already guarantee you we're taking this thing out. Communications are down. That should keep Exalt busy for a while. All right. I think I should should maybe just kind of move him the fuck in. Because like even if I kill some of these people, I'm not gonna like I'm not gonna get very far. Oh, I, you know what I'm gonna also do? I'm gonna use my little the, the, my little grenade here, and right on top of that fucking point. Right there. So they're gonna take some damage. One of our new little tools. I'm pretty certain I want to bring this guy right to the front line. Orders confirmed. Instead of shooting from all the way back there. Exalt almost has control of the encoder. If we don't stop them now, they'll be able to locate the transmitter. We have to get moving. <laughs> I got a ton of them on the point. They're flanking my position. I don't want to flank again. Next train coming in from the sides. I think we're going to have to bring someone on to the point as we get, like, another, maybe one of those other, this one over here, this guy. X-rays coming in from the sides! I think I'm going to have to fire another rocket in there, probably, as well. Oh, there we go. We, we heard... The motor is gone, Commander. Exalt is going to move directly on the transmitter now. We have to stop them. Okay. New objective. So we just learned what that did. Well, at least that solves my little problem here. Of uh, where's the rocketeer? At least I'm I'm weapons free on the point here. <laughs> Fucking hell. Guarantee you I'm gonna spend another turn here trying to get them off of the point. Great, you're not dead. Where's my engineer? Oh, there's more of them. Yeah, just do it like this. Even though, like, he needs to be closer to the center of the explosion. To... Wow, he didn't even take that one. Didn't even take damage. That's way lame. Headed there now. How many more do I have of these things? We disrupted the enemy communications network. It'll take some time for them to get it running again. What am I getting some flank shots off over like up here? On my way. 
He's doing ah that counts that does count as a flank though. That's that's what he's good for. I, I really should use him as a flanker more. Alright. Now here's the thing, we actually do have to move up with this guy. Heading to that location. Do we have any more terminals though? Uh, there's one over here, which means very soon there's going to come a turn where we are going to have to kind of just deal with what we got. Heading out. I think these guys will die to the poison, so let's let's go take out some of these smaller ones here. I like those odds. <laughs> Still has the damage reduction. He's got opportunists, but whatever, might as well just kill him. Because they regenerate their health. He doesn't have two shots yet. Bye bye. He's down. Oh, the oh that's gone, but uh it doesn't matter. Steady weapon. They're moving to flank me. Okay. Gonna blow. I see in panic. On the move. The Commander, we've got more hostiles closing on the AO. Oh, well, these are not the best uh, shots in the world. Yeah, I have a feeling we're gonna be um. Commander, Exalt forces are in position to hack the transmitter. We need to stop them before they wipe our data. I think we're gonna be doing it again. All right, let's see. Relative, yeah. So like this, like this is like the worst grenade. We have to do this. All right, he's gonna have to go and get this. Transmitter guaranteed. That should throw them off. It will take Exalt's people some time to get their communications back up and running. He's gonna be going through that door to the next one. Probably gonna use running gun to do that. We could probably just leave that fucker alone. Or maybe I can get a flank. Nah, I'd rather just leave him alone. He's really not worth it. Maybe I can get that one though. I mean that those are nice crits, so. Oh, Jesus Christ. Well they should be all out of ammo at this point, so. We'll go try and take this one out with Libby. Let's have a look here. Probably gonna have to move this person as far up to the point as I can in that one turn. These are some really awkward shots you got. Shame about not having crit. Uh, let's have a look here. Okay, this one can probably get taken down by me. Is that a, okay. is that can I shoot him from there? I hope. Yes, I can. I can even crit him. The angle was good. All right. Because the fact that I constantly need to reload a steady weapon right in front of my uh, infantry there. Yeah, there's a lot more in here now. As I said, these are not the best people for this job. We, we can't even get the transmitter during this turn. Wow. Oh, no, 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 we can't. It's the wrong person I'm looking at. Ah, oh, phew. Alright. I'll leave him till last, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to. I mean, I think for this guy, I might actually just go and, uh, reload. Dead and gone. 
the infantry kind of needs to do that. Well, I now at least kind of know what happens when you when the when the uh, transmitter has an issue. It's kind of interesting to note. Uh, let's get some reloads in. Uh, let's see. So we're definitely going to run and gun for that last one there. Yeah, there's no reason for this for us to be over here with this guy, so just reload him. Uh, and actually, this one will go kill, will shoot him in the face. Uh, we got one more here. I mean, it's going a little bit better than I thought it would, given the fact that I have so many rookies right now. Uh, actually, did I really need to do that? Motherfucker, I didn't really. I mean, we have one guy up there. Yeah, I guess in this case I will. Are there any more here that I can get? Okay, this is Enemy the last one. Are down. That should keep Excel busy for a while. I probably shouldn't have used that one. <laughs> we got opportunities to overwatch really nicely, though, with this guy. So it means he's probably going to get killed, despite not seeing anybody. I mean, making an Overwatch gunner wasn't the worst thing I've ever done. Uh, sorry, Rocketeer wasn't a, the worst thing I've ever done. I mean, he's only missing heat ammo, and for Exalt missions, it's a godsend. Alright. It looks like this is the last of the hostile reinforcements, Commander. We just need to hold out a little longer. Alright, so that guy's a bit of a problem. So that one. Oh, nice. We killed him anyway. Well, we didn't kill him, but he's close to it. Probably should have saved uh, that other shot for him, to be honest. Let's have a look. Oh my god, there's a ton of them here. Yeah, I really wish I would have saved it for this. Uh, maybe that AP grenade would be nice. Let's go, grenade. Yes, Commander. I was trying pistol on. We did have a, another grenade though, I probably should maybe try to use that. Alright. What's the gunner got? Just one shot, and it's on him. Alright. We're gonna take one shot here, and overwatch the second one. Here's my thinking, I'm just gonna go back here and try and shoot this guy. Because the farther away, away I am, the better off I am for, for shots, say. 100% 85. And that that's the unfortunate part. Um, I mean, we can go okay. in here and reload. I guess I'll just do one more overwatch here. Ah, that's unfortunate. Oh, they both use their overwatch. Damn. Hostiles pacify. I need ammo.
Yeah, I figured that there he'd rush the point. X-ray on the move. They're flanking us. They're repositioning on us. <laughs> okay. Oh, well, we got shot a little bit up. Uh, but I think we'll be okay. Rolling. Probably should have moved this person slightly more back. Oh, great. Oh, yeah, that's right. He's in cover relative to my guy. Oh, great. Oh. Rip in pieces. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna go back actually because that's what I should have done to begin with. I forgot I thought that guy had ammo on him, but he didn't. So I'm gonna I'm just gonna grenade him outright and then do something else with my medic. Because like seriously, I'm not losing someone to exalt just because of that. Hold up, uh, hold up. How far? Where are we right now? I see that encoder spinning. It, that's just showing me stuff. Okay. Yeah, 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 this is the right save. Okay, good. Alright. Um. Question is, where do I want to go? So I know there's a guy behind here, but we don't have to get him right now. Uh, let's let's start off with getting the gunner to fire on this guy. Eighty-five, and then there's a hundred. So I'm just assuming he's he's a gunner. Uh, okay, rocketer hat. Rocketer cannot do anything but reload. Aye, aye, commander. We're green to go. I mean, the sniper can get this guy. Eh, try it. Okay, that worked. Question then becomes. Oh, he can't. He can shoot him. Planted him. All right. Good Meg's gonna have to come back here and just heal himself. I mean, that's why I brought a medic along. But to be honest, it probably wasn't completely necessary. Alright, and the engineer will be here as backup. Suck on this. Really? <laughs> good, good, good shot. Okay. One damage and he completely absorbed it too. All right, we know there's one there, and there's also one kind of in the back, so. That's why we're overwatching with him. I know he's there, and then there was one over there, I think. There you go. Okay, so he's he's just running for the point. And we killed him. Now it's just the one behind us. Negative ammo. I'm spent. Alright. You ready to give us your, your Jesus shots? Ninety-one <laughs> percent. Uh whatever. I'm on it, Commander. Alright, four. Uh, well, we got a rocketeer here. I can shoot. Most of those, most of those like, rockets just disappeared at the beginning. Alright, that went pretty well. Uh, with the exception of the uh, guy who shot back. Well, the, the grenade handling on the way I handled the grenade. I was, I'm, this is why I'm not playing Iron Man, as I said. I, I want the opportunity to go back and go. I changed my mind, that's not what I want to do, kind of a thing. Lieutenant 2, murder. Oh yeah, it's this guy. I guess we'll do another sharpshooter for the full aim stuff. Oh yeah, this was my Overwatch gunner. If a unit fires without moving, it automatically enters Overwatch. Will just survive, or... 
Yeah, since it's Overwatch Gunner, might as well make him enter Overwatch at the end of his turn. Um, <laughs> this is my Overwatch uh, Medic, I forgot that's what I made this guy do. Alright, eliminates aim penalty on, on shots, alright. Every we're, we're all about the Overwatch today. And here we go, we actually got lock and load, which is nice. Because uh, we're building this one the same way. Only Nauruk or, or whatever was uh, wounded for a heavily amount of time. Oh, and this guy got upgraded. First, yeah, this is the thing I made the last guy do. I meant to do this thing. I always get rapid fire. Um, hit and run isn't actually that bad either. Uh, that's basically if you your first shot against the target doesn't cost an action if they're if we're flanking them. It's only one shot, first of all, and second of all, rapid fire works with run and gun, which makes it better. Excel intel decryption complete, eliminating statistical improbabilities for possible exalt location. Oh, we have uh, some possibility to potentially build something. Uh, let's have a look. Cybernetics Lab is still coming out. What else can we make? Oh, Genetics Lab. Everything requires four power. I'm debating making the fucking full-on uh, facility for for power, but I'd feel bad because then I'd just start wrecking everything else. I don't, know, I, don't, I don't think there's anything in particular. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh, maybe I should start this now. Yeah, okay. I thought I needed the Cybernex lab, but sure. And that takes 10 days, so... Uh, I didn't realize we we had the opportunity to make it. Well, it didn't matter, because I, I didn't have enough money anyways. Uh, no. Can't have that. Oh. Uh, let me launch satellites. This is the entire point of what I was trying to do. I almost fucked it up. Launched. Yeah, don't worry. We're, we're gonna deal with our intercept problem very soon. Satellite there you go. Capacity. Okay, so air, all aircraft and aircraft weapons cost 70% of the regular cost of purchase. There's still no sati there's still no interceptors in that in that country, but that's okay. We are extremely impressed with the progress of the XCOM project thus far, Commander. Your recent results were beyond our expectations, and that is not a statement this council makes lightly. Carry on. All right. Remember, we will be watching. We got a bunch more money. Uh, one sec. So I, I think I have some things I didn't sell from last mission, like this thing, the flight computer. Uh, and we go to hangar. So now interceptors cost 140 each. Uh, which is not too bad. I also want to buy some more soldiers soon. Uh, I need a bit more money though. I mean, I guess three will do for now. Yeah, I guess three will do. We'll, we'll deal with three for now, uh, and we'll we'll up it maybe next month or something. Ready in three days. There you go. There's our interceptors. So that that was the plan, basically, to to make the next month essentially have that. And delirium is finishing now. Uh, we have manufacturing this element is beyond our capabilities. Gelled Illyrium is ready for... So this is like a... a Full-size crafts, regulator and fuel systems, adding to our flamethrowers. I guess it's a mech thing. Alright, we also have some autopsies and... Uh, um, yeah, autopsies and more autopsies. I mean, after this, it's pro probably going to be... Mm, probably power systems, but we're, we're going to go interrogate the Muton first. Fucker's not happy. Alright, and I guess we'll just continue scanning. And they want 15 Thin Man Corpses for 2 Engineers. Okay, that's fine. We'll make everything faster, you know, there's no reason not to. 14 meld for money, no. We need the meld. Alright, and are the ships gonna go up? Yep, okay, ships are up. Let's have a look. All right, avalanche missiles. Oh, and well, we need to rename them. Chunk? No. Spitfire? No. Link? Skeeter? I like Skeeter. Okay. Skeeter's gonna go up. Rooster? Okay. Well, it has to be Rooster. Giggles? Do we have already have Giggles? Nope. Uh, that was in my last one. So yes, we we have Giggles now. Arrived this morning, Commander. 
We're always glad to have more help down here. And I'm just gonna show you the laser cannon now costs 69 bucks. Um, so we need to build a couple more of those too. Lasers are gonna come in, come in handy for shooting shit down. Uh, okay, apparently we lost one day from our uh, exalt from their exalt operation. So we're gonna just send someone out. The newer, the better, actually. Viking. Some guy named Viking. No, well, the the pistol upgrades are really nice, actually. So, yeah, that that's actually the. This is the this is the worst assault that we have, which is which is actually good to hear. So, give him some alloy plating, and uh, I guess the grenade is still a good idea, just because he can either blow up cover once or he can uh, uh, kill someone, like I tried to last time. Although it didn't really work out that well. So, I mean, we can't give him clips because that only uh, some vets on our side. primary weapon. It takes a serious pair to go face to face with one of those things. That's what you think. Like, I don't really know what else to give him. I, I, honestly, if there's something better than that, I would give him something better than that, but I don't have anything. To disrupt exalt cell in China. I wonder... Yeah, we, we, we still can't research the alien grenades, it looks like. Oh, no, here it is. Wow. Requires a lot of money. We should maybe th consider this. I'm actually going to go get that, just because I really want good grenades. Uh, we're gonna sell some something on the gray market, I think. Meld not researched. Let's just sell all our meld. You know, maybe I should get rid of things like the auto loader here, and because uh, I'm not using that really anymore. I'm debating getting rid of the arc rifle. I I tried it. I don't like it really. I'm getting rid of it. Fuck that thing. All right, how much money are we up? Okay, we just need one more thing. Just one floater then. All right, and what else could we get here? I'm just curious. Uh, we still need some more mutant corpse before ammo conservation is a thing. Next close combat is uh, uh, something about the connect strike module. I'm guessing that's the Malay thing that I saw earlier. Uh, shaped armor. I guess we're eventually gonna do that. Sentinel drone. We can defensive module for the shiv. It, uh, able to add the self repair capability. Uh, that would make shivs really, really powerful. But I haven't really built any, and nor do I really have the money for that, so. Let's do alien grenades, though. Engineers needed 35, and we're at 50, so. Alright. Ah, we got abductions. We picked up multiple requests Swarming. for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow globe. What the fuck, India? Get your shit together. Well, we got we got enough people now. Uh, most of the uh, we still have a couple of wounded people, but uh, I'm confident enough that we'll we'll pull through on this one. At least like 69th bullet is around. Because well, actually, Pussycat is going to be just one day out, uh, so it's not that bad actually. Um, so. We are gonna hire some new soldiers soon. I'm I'm mo mostly focusing on that for next month. This month we basically we got we got North America now, which is what we wanted. Uh, but I'm trying to now just ca make sure this is completely ours. The other thing that we could do, I'm thinking about it, is going after South South America next. Uh, the reason for that is it makes it makes the cost of power facilities much less. Which actually might be really worthwhile, considering we're about to get... I think we're going to go into Illyrium Generators, like... Actually, I don't, I'm not sure why we don't have it already. Now that I think about it. Yeah, no Illyrium Generators. What are we researching? Mutons? I guess it's alien power systems. So, uh, yeah, that's probably what we're going to go into next. Alien power systems it is, so... I guess that's it. Remember, we will be watching.